right guys welcome back to another vlog i hope you guys are having an amazing monday and a great start to this beautiful week i came back from work a little back and then i was editing a video i just finished it so i thought why not let's start a new vlog and show you some stuff but first of all i would like to show you the most important person in our house that is this guy right here yes do you know how important you are, Marvel? He's wearing this cone. Hmm. Do you want mommy to open the cone for you? Alright, I'll just open the cone for something. And I'll watch you. Sleep. So he sleeps till 4.30? or five and then he'll wake up and then he'll like play around a little bit because then it'll be his dinner time right look at that fish just i mean i mean i don't even have any words just look at that face and he has velvet ears oh god can you just talk ever or what look at the sleepy face <laughs> Oh, you're so beautiful, you sleep. All you need to do is sleep. Alright. So, we'll be going today once my Aang is off from his work. We'll be going to get Marvel Street. Because we are almost out of it. They're like literally 3-4 pieces. And you guys know he eats like 6-7 pieces in a day. Whenever he wants to eat a treat, he'll just go and sit right next to the treat box over there and it'll be like can i have some treat anyways so before i went to work this morning i wrote a few things here so that i don't forget the first thing is freeze mango so if you guys have seen my yesterday's vlog i cut up mango and i put it in a baking tray and put it in the uh, freezer and today uh, i'm gonna put it in the bags so that whenever i use them they're nice and separated and they don't become clustered and mushy when i use them and the second is check out broccoli chips so yesterday my was telling me that i want to eat broccoli chips so i was like which broccoli chips like the normal chips that come in packet he was like no i saw a video where you use take broccoli and eggs and cheeses and then mix it and then make bake them into a chips like thin chips so i'm gonna check out that recipe where he found it and then i need to cook quinoa just plain quinoa i'm gonna cook and keep it in the fridge uh for a week so that Every day when I come back from work, I have uh, I eat healthy and I don't just grab anything that I see the first day, and I can just cook up like fish or something like you know something very easy with quinoa kind of thing. So yeah, that's the plan. Uh, I need to do a little bit, a little bit of dishes over here. So yeah, let's first freeze the mango. Let's start. So basically you can see the mango they're all nice and separated and this and now i will now baby i'm gonna give you treats don't do that don't take your cone come here i'm gonna give you mango and now i'm just gonna put them here Instant bottle is very simple. I'm just gonna add a little bit of olive oil. <laughs> what happened? Who is it?
Look at the way I am sweating. You guys saw the whole workout that I did. If you guys want to try it, do try it. Oh God. I'm gonna go take bath. My heart rate is 156 right now. And look at them. I know you can't open it. <laughs> when I work out, nobody's allowed in. Right, Marvel? Mommy was doing the jumping right. time over there. Jumping time? What? Mommy was doing the jumping time. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna go take bath and I'm gonna see you in some time. Alright. I'm done with my bath and I feel so good and I feel so energetic now that I am done with my workout. I don't know why for some reason every time I work out I get more energized after that. Let me reduce the volume. Don't bring the buzzer for 19. Alright. And my quinoa is also nice and ready here comes out so fluffy you can see every time I make it in the instant pot and why is it blurring me hello ooh, ooh. all right so I'm just letting it cool down and then I'll keep it in the fridge and tonight for dinner I'm for myself I'm gonna be making fish and zucchini so I'm gonna show you how I make it it's very simple but yet super delicious and healthy and I'm gonna make a snack right now snack is going to be super easy I'm gonna take rice cake let me show you how what I do. have these rice cakes I'm gonna take out one two of them for both for me and my young and I'm gonna use tomato avocado and uh, everything everything bagel hold on yeah everything but the bagel sesame seasoning and it's that's it so simple let me show you real quick It's like a toast, but instead of bread, I'm using uh, rice cakes because they're much healthier and less calorie. And they are in which flavor? These are white cheddar flavor. So freaking good, trust me. Very, very good. Okay. How they look the end result it looks pretty it's super delicious and healthy so, so let me just take a bite mm -mm -mm. Oh it's so good well tomato is so refreshing mm. I love it let's look at them mm. I'm sure watching me you guys gonna go you wanna go and make it go and make it mm, it's delicious I'm making dinner we're done with Marvel's walk and I know you guys haven't seen Mayan yet but he's just coming he's just doing the last bit of the thumbnail for the, <laughs> the vlog that is going to be out tonight so that is what he's doing so he is not hungry but I am so I'm gonna make fish. This is rockfish. And with this, I'm gonna have, where is my zucchini? I'm gonna have one zucchini. I'm gonna bake these two in the oven. And then remember the quinoa that I prepared? I'm gonna just take a little tiny bit of quinoa on the side and that's it. So for my fish, let's see. I'm very confused of what kind of seasoning I wanna put because rockfish as it is, it has a lot of flavor. So let's see. I have a seasoning this is gourmet seasoning seafood for especially for seafood it has dill lemon paprika garlic lime rosemary parsley chili onion for every kind of fish so maybe I'm gonna use this, this one
all right so this is how my baking tray looks like there's a fish and zucchini i'm gonna put it in the oven it's preheating at 400 degrees fahrenheit and i'm gonna play like let it cook for like 10 minutes and fish will be done and these will also be done so i am planning to make cafe mocha hot for myself so i'm gonna use this is so this is the recipe i'm gonna use chocolate syrup here and this is dark chocolate syrup look at that beautiful cup and then i'm gonna brew light rose coffee and um the shot and then i'm gonna make milk like froth milk let's see i have my uh, two percent fat lactose free milk All right, I'm gonna use my frother. Let's add milk. overnight oats and we love overnight oats now that we have fresh mango i've been making it daily and um I'm, i take it to work and he eats it for his lunch so today when i'll be making it for tomorrow's work i'm going to show you how i make it it's super simple and so delicious and also very filling and healthy and with fresh mangoes i usually add mangoes and blueberry oh my god all right just waiting for my coffee and then I'll show you how it is so there is coffee in here I'm just gonna mix it if you like iced cafe mocha I'm gonna show you the recipe some other time but definitely I'll show it to you but today check this recipe out for hot uh, cafe mocha so chocolate and coffee is mixed very nicely i use i like using dark chocolate if you like milk chocolate use a milk chocolate syrup but mine is special dark okay perfect my milk is also ready you can see it's nice and frothy and now hold it Oh, oh, oh look at that look at the frog trust me this is so so good i'm gonna take all the frog out that just looks pretty on the top Now just look at this. Oh god, it's so pretty. Oof. Do you think I should mix it? Yes, let's mix it and taste it. It looks like hot chocolate, but trust me, so good. Oh my god this is so good i don't know why but is it i think it's because of the dark chocolate it's tasting so so good babe i think <clears throat> the cafe mocha that i'm drinking right now will be your next favorite mm, or should i say first favorite no i think next favorite after caramel latte 
It's so good. Let's go. I'll just make him taste and let's see how he likes it. Oh god, it is so good. Yeah. Is it drinkable? It's not, yeah, it's drinkable. Ooh, look at that. Oh, but it's so dark. Alexa? Mm. Stand this side. Yeah, better. Mm. Oh yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. It's so good. Coffee and chocolate. Perfect cafe mocha. Yeah. We'll try even cold. Yeah, I'm sure cold will be good. So do try this recipe. It's very, very good. I showed you guys like how many? Mm. Uh, two recipes today? Right? Mm. And I don't know. Yeah. I think I'm in the vlog for the first time today. Yeah. So yeah, do try it. It's very good. I'm just waiting for my fish to get ready. Bake. Because I'm very hungry. Alright guys, this is how my dinner looks like. I have a tiny bit of quinoa that I cooked in the afternoon. The zucchini. And my fish. Look at that. It is so nice and flaky. Look at that. Ooh. I'm gonna go enjoy my dinner while we watch the Old Guard movie. Yeah. Right babe? And he's not eating anything because he's not hungry. So, so yeah, I'm gonna go, and I'll see you guys when I make oats, overnight oats, uh, for tomorrow. Uh, we actually just finished the movie. The movie is super duper cool, awesome, amazing. If you get a chance, watch it. Uh, it's 10:10, 10, 10, uh, but normally we would hit the bed by this time. But Tanya had to make the overnight oats, and I'm gonna show you how she is making it. Marble. Over here, she has she has two mason jars, and uh, these are like breakfast size jars, as you can see. And she has three things in there. She has oats, she has chia seeds, and she has a protein powder in there. Vanilla protein. Once that's in there, she is cutting up the mango it's and. I'm yeah. gonna add milk. Yes. So this is lactose free, zero percent fat. Oh wait, this is two percent. Two percent fat, and but this is like reduced fat free. Yeah, lactose free, reduced fat, two percent fat milk, and milk goes in. Now, you saw how simple it was. She added the oats, she added the chia seeds, she added the protein powder, gave it a mix, 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 mix. She added milk in it. Now because uh, these are called overnight oats because the oat is gonna swell up in the milk so it's not gonna be this liquidy that you yeah. saw. Then on top of this she's gonna add the best antioxidant fruit. Yes. Blueberries and my favorite. Huh. So she's gonna add blueberries and she's gonna add mango which is the seasonal fruit right now. But like you saw that how she freeze it and we freeze it, it lasts for an year and we uh, let me just see. So you see, we have such a big packet of blueberry. Yeah, this is a three pound packet of blueberry and uh, we always have blueberries. Yeah. They are the best antioxidants and the best thing is that on the if you see the ingredient, like I say, always buy single ingredient food. Yeah. So if you're buying a packaged fruit, try to buy single ingredients. So it only has just frozen blueberries, yeah. nothing in ingredients. So very clean ingredients that you can pronounce and uh, she added the blueberries in there and she's gonna add the uh, mango in there and that is it That's pretty much it. We always like to buy frozen blueberry because First thing if you don't buy the frozen one they go bad fast. Yeah and, uh, Or we buy the normal ones and end up freezing it. So it doesn't really make sense yeah, we did that uh, last time, And then this time we saw the frozen was cheaper than the normal one. So we got the frozen one yeah. Simple. So anyways, uh, I'll show you once she top it up with the mangoes as well. And uh, it is already looking delicious. And by the way, guys, if you do not know, it says King's Breakfast and Queen's Breakfast. Uh, mm -hmm. Ashley actually uh, did that for us. Yeah. For our beloved new subscribers, if you do not know who Ashley is, that's our sister-in-law, sister-in-law, and uh, she runs this business, uh, 
for you know t-shirts and everything and i'll put a link for her in the description box below you feel free to check it out on etsy for her and show some love maybe if you like something yeah. Uh, so yeah so we have that and uh, she's oh my god these mangoes smell so good <laughs> I have to call the farm and ask for another crate of this particular mango Pickering. pickering. This is super good. The other day when I went actually they didn't have pickering. Uh, they only had two baskets left of pickering and baskets are small. Uh, I need Did you get the baskets? Uh, I think ten? it's 10 pounds. Yeah. Oh 10 pounds. Yeah. And it's just 10 dollars. And yeah. like you get 10, 10 mangoes in them or? And you get a 35 pound uh, box for 35 bucks. Um, so yeah, I mean, I'm gonna give them a call and see if they have a box of Pickering available because we were anyways gonna go for sudden blush, sudden blush. so, uh, I don't wanna miss Pickering. I mean, I've fallen in love with this fruit. Um, so let's see. We know for sure the sudden blush is very good, yeah. but... Yeah, and Pickering is super cool. Yeah. Do you want more mango? I can, actually. Okay, let me take out one more mango. A small one, maybe. <laughs> because this morning it had more mangoes, right? Huh? Today's oatmeal had more mangoes. Yeah. Yeah, it was full all the way up. Yeah. Here you go. I take care of the goodly. <laughs> it okay. is super yummy. Yeah. Pickering is very sweet. Marvel is gonna come here <laughs> hmm. because even Marvel knows the taste of mango now. So anytime we eat mango, he'll be like, "Can I yeah. have some?" I don't give him all the time. Yeah, I let him lick a little bit on the end. seed at the end, and yeah. that to just once a day, maybe. Are you, are you being such a good boy? So daddy gives you mango? Hmm? Can you take a little lick? Gently, yes, gently. Thank you, that's it. That is it for him. <laughs> Now it feels like overnight mango woods. Oh, there is another one. Yes. Over here. Look at that. And we are gonna just close it, keep it in the fridge. Breakfast is ready. So, anyways, I. Uh oh. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed all the recipes that Dr. Like Tanya. Yeah, so Tanya we'll threw at you. To, uh, the all healthy, all amazing recipes. Please, yeah. please, please try them, use them. Let us know in the comment box how you like them. Thank you for watching us and showing us so much love and support. Uh, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and comment. And we are gonna see you in our next vlog. Until then. Bye.